New at noon, Orange County firefighters are working to stay prepared for any potential diving emergency. Yeah, New 6 was there this morning as the first responders showed off their new training program meant to help get results during water rescues. New 6's Emily McLeod has the story. Firefighters with the Orange County Fire Rescue are taking a plunge by becoming rescue divers for the department. So for us at Orange County Fire Rescue, we always wanted to be an all hazards fire department. So if you call 911, we're going to be able to handle what that emergency is. In this case, water rescue. The need for rescue divers becoming even more prevalent as firefighters responded to two separate water calls involving cars crashing into retention ponds. One happening at the end of January on Alafaya Trail and the second happening on February 14th on Goldenrod. We have those calls, calls cars that go into retention ponds, missing swimmers, missing boaters. And we want to be able to assure that when we respond to that call, we're getting there quickly with people that can affect that rescue right away and hopefully have a good recovery. Currently, there are around 20 firefighters in the program. Tuesday's training involved four skill stations simulating different situations they may find themselves in underwater. Right now, we're what we call pool phase, is where they learn the fundamentals of becoming a rescue diver, kind of taking them out of the recreational world and putting them into the public safety diving world. Now, even though this training is very rigorous, firefighters with the Orange County Fire Rescue say it's all worth it to be able to save more lives. It's a great feeling just to you know, like go in there, be able to make a save, make a grab, and bring them out to a partner that you trust, that you know is on the rescue, that's going to help that person to the best of their abilities. It's, it's an awesome feeling. In Orange County, Emily McLeod getting results, News 6.